Uh, so Cold Response 20 is a Norwegian national defense exercise uh, in conjunction with its NATO allies. Norway offers a unique uh, Arctic environment that's very challenging and provides a great opportunity to improve our ability to operate in an austere environment. In total, there are approximately 1,500 Marines participating in this exercise. Uh, we have equipment coming from both the states, but also from the Marine Corps Preposition Program in Norway. The cave sites included Tromsdal, Fregard, and Bjorn. Uh, we then convoyed the equipment over the course of six days from those cave sites to Varnes Garrison. Uh, once all the equipment was at Varnes Garrison, it was consolidated and the using units then had a joint effort uh, consisting of over 12 convoys over the course of two days to transport equipment from Varnes to Orkonger Port. At Orkonger Port, we consolidated all of our stateside equipment with what we drew from the McPippin cave sites, unloaded the ship there at Orkonger and then transported it north to Bogan Pier. Uh, once at Bogan Pier, over the course of a day, we were able, with our combined effort, to not only receive all of the uh, main body flights that were arriving, uh, but also transport the 550 pieces of principal end items from Bogan Pier to uh, the destination at Elfgardsmoen, Bjergvik, Norway. Um, I would say the United States is very grateful to Norway for allowing us to be here. It's a great opportunity to improve our interoperability with the Kingdom of Norway as well as with the uh, participating NATO ally forces. With today's current environment, no nation can operate effectively on its own. It takes allies and it takes working together to ensure the defense and the safety of all countries in the NATO alliance.